Hello everybody, welcome back to Mind Hair Isles. So today is obviously Sunday and it's the second Sunday of the month and obviously that's going to be the second day of my Something Else Sunday series. So this package arrived earlier in the week. I have got it turned over. The other side has my address on and stuff and I tried to remove it but it just isn't coming off so there's nothing I can really do about that. So this is the package that I ordered from eBay. Now I think I ordered about... I don't know, around about six, maybe seven squishies. And what I made to do was I made sure that all the squishies were under 99 pence, so under a pound, which is about, I don't know, 70 cents in US dollars, I do believe. Yeah, like I think that's the exchange rate right now. I think it's like 70 cents per one pound. So all of them are less than that each. And I think I spent, yeah, I definitely spent less than six pounds. I was going to spend less than five pounds, but then I felt like, oh, I found another one and I just kind of added it on. I think it was like a set of two donuts. Now, the size of this package is worrying me just a little bit. Like, can we talk about how small this is? So six squishies in that, I'm just like, okay. I made sure to order them all from one seller so that it would end up in one bag to see what they would come like. Otherwise, if they came in loads of separate bags, I know that I would have opened them all up and that's just the type of person I am, I would have sneak peeked and that is like me. So yeah, so here's the package. It's worryingly small. Like one of the pictures showed, okay, I'll give you a little hint. One of them was a peach and it kind of looked like the eye bloom peach and it kind of looked like a big one. So there's no way that there's a peach in here. Like all these shapes do not feel like a peach. So either they've missed it or I don't really know. I don't know what's gonna be in here. I just don't know. So maybe we should just open this up. So I'm just gonna go and cut the package um, so that we can actually get into it without showing my address and I'll be back. Okay, so the package is open. This is what I can see. So there are some real small squishies inside of here. I am actually just gonna cut off my address because that's gonna be really annoying. I mean, I could have just emptied them out, to be honest. There we go, my address is off. So here's what we have. There's a lot of pink in there. So let's start with this cake because this cake looks like the most appealing. Okay, so to start off with, I have this little cake. If my camera will focus, there we go, we've got it. And this is attached with a little keychain. Let's give it a squeeze. Oh, actually, you know, it's not too bad. I wonder if it smells. Let me smell this. No. It doesn't smell of anything. Like, literally nothing. Like, not even, like, a chemical smell. It doesn't smell of anything. Oh. Did you see that? Like, this paint just came off. <laughs> oh. Well, it's nice and slow rising. I mean, it's broken there. This is kind of disappointment. But for 99p, what can you expect? Maybe in a video I might decorate this. Let me know what you think. Maybe we should decorate this cake on my channel. Yeah, that's quite a good idea actually. Do a decorating squishy. So that's the first one. Next we have what looks to be like little donuts. Oh yeah, this was the actual one. They're both the same. But this was the one that I said about that. I wanted to order five, but then I seen this, it was like two for 99p or something, so I just picked those up. They're a lot smaller than what I was imagining. I was expecting something to be like quite a bit bigger, but these are quite small. It was also like a random color assortment as well, and these both seem the same, exactly the same color, so uh, that's a bit of a disappointment. Let's open these up, because they are in little packages. I have a little smell test as well. Oh, they feel really strange. This bit here kind of looks like coconut. Can you see that? Like, it's like shredded plastic, but it feels and looks like coconut. Oh, they smell bad. Like, they smell like chemicals, pure chemicals. I mean, that can't be any good for you, can it? I'm still gonna squish it anyway. Maybe if I leave this out of the packaging, they won't smell so bad. Oh my goodness, like this just already coming off. This was, this was a bad video. This one smells the exact same. They just smell really bad. Maybe if I leave them out for a couple of days and yeah, like I said with that pink cake, maybe I could decorate these too because 
the design on it isn't very good and you know all this stuff is literally just falling off in my hands like I could just pick it off as well not that you aim to pick it off obviously um but yeah definitely need to do something with these otherwise that's just a waste of money we can make these really cute little kawaii donuts little cute face yeah oh now we've got two actually we could do like a little best friend pair they could be on key rings you can make best friend squishes out of these might be cute so there's those next inside is this little whale i would have thought they would put these all in packaging but they seem to have come out what is that it's like a pen on it can you see come on focus can you see that like here yeah, there's just like little marks on this oh it's so also misprinted like here's its eye and like the print is down so far like can you see like the smile isn't in there that eyes that eyes in the perfect place but this one should be a little bit further up either way it doesn't matter let's give it a little squish oh um G. That is what we like to see in here. Oh, this squishes so well. Oh my goodness. Now, I can't compare this to the original Mini Lou Whale because I don't have it. But, I can imagine obviously it would be better quality, but this squishes so nicely. I, I cannot believe this. Look at that. Slow rising, super soft, super defective, but only 99 pence. So can we complain really? Probably not. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, Millie. Well, gee, you're not called Millie because you're a ripoff or a dupe or whatever you want to call it. What should we call you? Not Millie, Tilly. No, because it's already called Tilly. Mm, I don't know, we'll call her Nilly. Nilly with an N. Nilly the whale. <laughs> oh, anyway, that's so cute. I'm going to stop playing with that because this is so satisfying. Oh, I love it. Okay, next up. Yes, I knew this was coming. I already have one of these. I based a squishy off of it not so long ago, but I really liked it and I wanted to get another one. So that's this one, just the little keychain one. I know there's jumbo ones available and there's like medium sized ones available also of this design. But obviously I wanted to get one under 99 pence and this was what I found. What is that? It has got some like quite big air bubbles. Can you see that right by the mouth? painting isn't that great but let's give it a go oh not too bad nowhere near as squishy as this nilly <laughs> look at that slow rising this of this it's just perfect that is what we like to see it also feels so so soft like this feels a little bit textured like not just obviously the texturing on it but like it just it doesn't feel quite smooth but you know 99 pence we can hang it on our bags. We could pop it on our keys. It could be a cute little addition. Yes, I really like this. This isn't bad. This doesn't need repainting. It's okay. It looks cute as it is, and I'm not disappointed. For 99p, I think that's a real bargain. So next up in the bag, oh, oh, do you see that? Do you see that? That's a mini peach what honestly i ordered what is this this is the smallest peach i've ever seen <laughs> what let me go on my phone a second okay right i'm back with my phone let me see if i can show you this like look at the size of this peach look at the size of the one i got what like can you see my like that in the like, uh, no wonder, as you can see here, it was 99p, but what? No wonder I was so confused when the package arrived. I thought no way a peach could fit in there. Like I couldn't feel it, but obviously I couldn't feel this. This is so small. I mean, it's squishes nice. I'm just so confused. Like, 
Huh? I expected this to be so much bigger. But yeah. The painting's okay. Like, we have got this little seam mark going all the way around. 99p, I can't really... I can't really complain about any of them because literally 99p and, like, what, £6 for seven squishies, so... Yeah. It is nice and slow rising. Like, look at that thumbprint. Yes! But a little bit disappointing at the size. This is so small. I'm really confused as to why it is so small. Maybe they sent me the wrong one. I don't really know. Maybe they're just scamming people. I don't know. I like it. I mean, I was just disappointed at the size. I mean, it could go on my bag. Basically, it's just a rip off the mini eye bloom peach. And I've already made myself one of those, so... There's that. This is much more slow rising than the one I made though, so. <laughs> I just find squishies so mesmerizing that like you can squish them as flat as you want and they just go ping right back up to the size that you want. So, yep, there's that one. Chuck that over there. I should get rid of these packages too. These are from the donuts, but. And the last but not least, we have. <laughs> galaxy poop squishy what is going on there it's like a chunk here we've got an air bubble here we've got paint coming off here maybe that's because they weren't put in like their own individual plastic bags like these like i think that's maybe why like maybe they've stopped oops did you see that but look the paint just came off oh what's good this is not my luck today honestly uh, yeah, the looks like the paint and stuff just stuck to the inside of that bag, so it's all kind of like peeling off, which isn't great. But this guy is so super cute. I did actually do a DIY on this the other day, actually, um, of a galaxy poop. So yeah, maybe I should compare the two. Maybe I should do one of those tags. Like, I know I seen. I think it was like Ketchup Geary who did um, like her homemade ones versus one she's bought. So maybe I'll do something like that. Let me know in the comments if you like to see something like that. Um, but yeah, let's give this a squish. Oh my goodness. What? This squishes so well. Almost like the little Nilly, the whale. Let's give it a go. What? These guys are definitely made out of the exact same thing. For sure. These two are so good. Like, honestly, I couldn't recommend these two enough. Like, sure, they are completely full of defects. Completely full. But, I mean, if that doesn't bother you, it doesn't bother me. I mean, a squishy is for squishing. And if it's that cheap, then if it has some defects, then in my eyes, it doesn't really matter. But, oh my goodness. This, honestly, squishes so well. Let's have a smell. Oh my God. Oh my God. What is that? It smells like berries. Like, berries. I don't know what type of berries. Blueberries? Strawberries? I don't know. Grape? Something berry and fruity. Oh my goodness. Do I smell? Nilly doesn't smell of anything. How about the peach? This doesn't smell of anything, but this... Oh my goodness, this smells so good. What? I'm just gonna sniff into the camera. This smells so good. It squishes so good. It's totally defect. Look at that. Look at that. 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 Oops. Maybe he just needs a new paint job. Oh, that is something that we can do. Maybe I should do a video also, instead of just like remaking ones I bought, like to do a decorated one so let me know also if you want to see that if you want to see me decorating defective squishies to kind of make them better because obviously we are a diy channel and unboxing stuff is cute but if we can do a diy with it too then i'd say that's even better so yeah there's that one so we have this squishy this one this one these two donuts which were totally chemically and gross this one um, and that's it. So yeah, 
how many is that one two three four five six seven yes yeah, seven like i said and it cost me five pounds 94p five pound 94p yes five pound 94p for all seven squishies which i think is an absolute bargain even though they're completely defective but for this little guy and this little guy i would say that's a bargain my camera battery died this is turning into disaster sunday there, there, there. see this is turning into disaster sunday like i can't speak properly my squishies have turned up defected my camera battery keeps dying and this just isn't happening today but you know i'm still doing daily uploads i can't let anybody down so i'm still here trying and trying and trying like honestly i've been recording for like half an hour now and i'm probably just gonna make a a five minute video out of all these clips because disaster um would i recommend these squishies probably not probably not i don't really like these ones i mean they're okay we can spruce them up for 99p they're okay but they do smell really chemically so i'm not gonna do anything with them for at least a couple of days i'm gonna leave them air out and see what happens because i don't want to be messing around with anything that smells that toxic and i don't think that anyone else should either so if it still does smell really bad in a couple of days i'll probably just pop them in the bin um this little squishy was definitely a disappointment to the one that was on my ebay i mean this is completely different to the picture completely different size like here's my hand i haven't got abnormally large hands or small hands or no large hands um so yeah um these two however i would totally recommend these i mean they are full of defects um if you don't mind that then i would say that these are great squishies because they just do what you want them to do they're slow rising they feel really nice they're super soft they but well, at least this one smells really good um but yeah they are full of defects but for 99p i don't think that you can really complain these two here are okay i mean this little guy i would recommend this one because i already have one of these and this is my second um i just really like them i think i just think their little faces are so cute and they're quite similar to um my youtube icon so yeah i'd probably recommend this one this one here again full of defects like the paint here has come off like i said i think that's just because they weren't put in clear packets for themselves they were just thrown into the bag and then maybe like they've stuck to the bag or something like i have seen that happen before it's also ripped here like not ripped like a little bit like quite substantially like i'm not pulling that very hard obviously it's foam just pull it hard oh i just pulled it hard and it ripped so much so yeah for a basis for like practicing like decorating squishes and stuff like that i think that's a really good thing to buy like 99 pence you can't really go wrong um it squishes really nicely it's not too slow rising so like i said defects if you're not you know too bothered about defects then maybe cheaper squishies are the way to go for you because then you'd save so much money and get the same sort of squishiness but yeah that's all that i bought for six pounds i reckon that it was it was super worth it for six pounds like six pounds can't really get you a lot these days <laughs> everything's so expensive Maybe that's just because I've become an adult, so I realise how expensive things are, I'm not really sure. But, yeah, here's all the squishies, and yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this Something Else Sunday. I know it was a bit of a fail, because my squishies were defective. This guy was too small. These are ugly. These cute things that would usually be cute are defected. Ugh, my camera battery died. Um... But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video anyway. Now, a lot of people in my last video have been asking me to do a face reveal. This is something that I definitely want to do. Um, I think that I'm going to do it at 25,000. 25,000 subscribers and I would do a face reveal. I've said it now, so there's no backing out of it, which I'm not exactly pleased about. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I, do, I don't know if I'm going to make it a video by itself or do it, say, like um, in another unboxing where I actually film myself at unboxing. I don't really know give me your suggestions and let me know what you feel um yeah and i'll basically just see you in tomorrow's video so if you like it please give it a thumbs up and yeah i'll be back tomorrow bye